So like any other day, I have the itch to go fishing. And where we're at right now in northern Minnesota, there's kind of an in-between time going on. Yesterday I was out ice fishing. Not all the area lakes are frozen over. And so I still want to be able to get out in my boat. It's a little troublesome at night when you're storing your boat outside or whatever to um, have water in your lower unit and risk freezing it and damaging your motor. So what I've done today is I've loaded up my Old Town kayak. So I'm running fairly light here. I've got a small box in my tackle. The kayak's got a ton of storage options. I like having the stuff right in front of me within arm's reach. See, we got ice on the river right here, which is right where I'm going to be fishing. Get some decent open water. It does not look that warm out. this rail system. So we got this paddle holder alongside and I opt to just use half the paddle in it because it's nice to have the other half of the paddle within arm's reach and I can do some kind of quick mod pushing off from close to shore or a quick steer. Especially in shallow water when this propeller might be bumping bottom. I can lock the pedal system up and I can use the half paddle to get me around. I can honestly say that's a first for me. Swim jig, little wall <laughs> right off this break. That's pretty cool. Definitely marking some fish down there. It goes from like three to almost 18 feet. So there's a sharp little river edge right here. Nice walleye. I made the decision with the way the wind is blowing to go all the way at the end of this shoreline and just make a nice controlled drift back. The really nice thing about the kayak is when I'm drifting like this, all I gotta do is make subtle movements with this rudder back here, and I can basically maintain, you know, a horizontal drift. Uh-oh. <laughs> Pike, shallow too, floppy, floppy. So where I caught that walleye, it was 34 degrees. That's right around this corner here. And where I am now is 44 degrees. It's 10 degrees warmer even. And I'm just using this swim jig to try to mimic a bluegill. There's tons of little bluegills in here. And that's what the pike and the bass and everybody's after, those little morsel-sized bluegills. So I got a black and blue swim jig. I'm just rolling it through the remaining green weeds. Really one of the slickest things with this kayak is that I have hands-free fishing. If you're fighting wind or something like that, you're constantly having to readjust with a paddle. This way, I take one hand off my rod, I can switch my rudder just like that, and the nose of my kayak is now switched and I can make a good cast at a good angle. 
And basically the whole time I can mosey along like this and make a cast and just fish. I don't have to worry about nothing. There we go. There's gotta be a bass. <laughs> Dig in deep. Back off on him. Oh, what is it? Ooh, pikey. Another nice pikey. That's a pretty decent pike there. Kind of fun. Bye. Once again, I'm gonna check my line. So when I'm fishing this swim jig, I like to fish a heavy rod. This is a 13 Envy, it's a 7.3 heavy. And I got a 13 Inception on here, super fast reel, eight to one gear ratio. And I'm throwing braid, and I can get away with braid because it's not a super cold day. It's like 42, it was about 42 for the high today. Typically, if I'm gonna fish a little colder water, I'm gonna wanna use a fluorocarbon, which is a lot better at not absorbing water. And, you know, you're likely to freeze up like that. You can get some coiling issues. And so I'm getting away with throwing braid today. And again, I'm throwing a swim jig. I like that braid. It's gonna be a, you know, a lightning strike of a hit. I got a heavier rod. I can set the hook. I can drag them through these cattails or any of the green weeds that I got left and I can pick up pick up line in a hurry with this eight to one gear ratio reel. It's getting to be that time of year where the lakes are freezing. I just had the kayak right up along the edge of the ice back there. And I'm not quite ready to give it up yet. So I'm coming out here and I'm fishing slow with a jig and a swim jig. And really just kind of getting bit. There we go. Yep, that's a good. Oh yeah, come on, come up, be a bass. Kinda looks like it, I don't know though. It's another nice pike. Yeah, a little pike there. Pike smashing. Pike. Nice norski. Oh, oh boy, that's a good fish right there. What is it? It's another pike. Tons and tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of pike. Check your line every time after running with a pike. Got bit off by a pike. Oh. There's a dogfish! Got the same dang fish. At least we're getting bit. Oh my goodness! There's a good rip. There's gotta be another pike. Yep. Kinda like to catch a bass. Maybe. Catching quite a few pike, a bass would be nice. They're definitely here. The water temp is decent enough at 58. But I'm just in here jacking jaws. I'm basically just in here scratching the last itch of the season before I go fully into ice fishing. Obviously with this system, I've got a pedal drive. And the nice thing about this is I can pick it up to speeds of about five, six miles an hour, depending on how hard I want to work. So like right now, it's the end of the day, I'm wrapping up. I just want to get back to the truck, starting to get a little cold. I'll kick it down into gear. And if I want to do some like putting away of things, I have my hands free. So I can dig around, shut my graph off, put some tackle away, this and that. And actually I can pedal this thing quite a bit faster than I would be able to paddle it. You notice I do have my paddles with me. There's a convenient little paddle holder over here, but I only need half of it for what I'm doing. If it's a little shallow, the propeller down here sticks down a little bit. This helps me maneuver. And if I wanted to, I could I have the paddle option. But it's also nice, especially in this cold weather, not being, not having to have the water drip over your lap or on your hands or something like that. So I, I really appreciate this pedal system in this kayak. 